People across this country, though, are still trying to find stores selling masks to try to protect anyone against COVID-19, specifically our medical professionals. CBS 13's Rachel Wolf, though, says that some in the Sacramento area have found some of those masks in an unexpected place. They lined up outside the Falling Prices store in Carmichael, standing six feet apart in light of the coronavirus outbreak, waiting for the doors to open. No. I keep my mask on and have my wipes, gloves. Some were in protective gear, others looking for it. Falling Prices had gloves and N95 masks. It just happened to be that way. We just happened to get masks and we're trying to get them out um, to our customers as quickly as we can. But just as soon as the first 75 customers were allowed in, the masks were snatched out of the bins. So will they be getting more? I'm not necessarily sure of what's on that manifest, so we could be getting more. Um, I know that we have been working to get more trucks like that. The discount store, known for its appointment-based app, they have a number to come in. is now making changes at one of their three Sacramento locations. The Arden Fair Falling Prices store typically only has clothing, but a representative for the company said today they actually started selling grocery type items to accommodate a growing need. They're selling toilet paper, cleaning supplies, and food, even pet food, all essentials, and people are lining up to fill up their carts. It's just very hard right now. It's very hard for everybody. As customers and businesses try to navigate a world amidst the coronavirus pandemic. And N95 masks, as you all know, are difficult to find. As a result, federal and state authorities have asked businesses to donate them if they can, but it has not been made a mandate.